Hey, what is going on? This is Tam Pham from BotAcademy.com, and we have Obeid Ahmed, founder of BotMock.com. Obeid, welcome. Hi, guys. And Obeid, what are we doing today, man? Well, Tam, we're going to basically build a prototype of a bot, chatbot. Sweet. And so I, I first found out about BotMock when I was like, trying to map out my bot on Google Docs, which is a horrible idea to do. It's very unorganized, very like disoriented. And I was like, what if there was a tool or software that can map out the flows of my logic trees? Like if they click yes, they're interested, then they'll get this sequence. Or if they click no, then they'll get this follow-up sequence or, or whatever. What, why isn't there a software that can help me map that out? And I saw your website, BotMock. I was super impressed. I was like, man, I have to reach out to the team. And I want to show you how to map out your own flows, your own sequences, and even the messages in your sequence um, through BotMock right here. And we'll do a little demo. I'll be a client, and uh, Obeid will be the, the bot creator uh, asking me questions about what I actually want in the sequence. And he'll draw, you know, he'll map it out uh, live on BotMock.com. Does that sound good? Yeah, absolutely. Sweet. Yeah. So, um, okay, my, name, my new name is Rich. Rich. <laughs> uh, let's, let's create this e-commerce bot. Yes, I have an e-commerce store. <laughs> awesome. All right, so the first thing to know is when we're creating a bot, I'll just walk you guys through a little bit, is to understand the purpose of your bot. So tell me what is the core purpose of your chatbot. Okay, my name is Richard. I want to sell fitness products and my fitness coaching as well. So I have a couple of like t-shirts and like water bottles and all that stuff. But I also have like these premium coaching um, uh, services that I, I want to help other people. So that's my goal of the buy. Okay, awesome. So essentially the first thing you need to do is to see what happens when they first arrive at your bot, right? So we start you off with a simple template. It's basically says, hey, they tapped on get started button. And now the first message they're going to see is, what what do you want to put that on so we will put something up like welcome to my let's say fitness shop sure <laughs> and the other thing that you have to notice that the the way the facebook messenger works is that you send as many as messages as you want but you gotta be able to create a connection with them so we define an action. We'll, we'll say that this is what happens every time they click on chat, get started and the first time they show up here. Now, nice. you introduce what your shop name is and you can take, customize it as you want. But next, we let's give them a couple of options. Ooh. So now, we have a library of all the components and templates that Facebook Messenger offers. And we keep on adding more and more as Facebook adds more and more templates. So let's say we will give them a button right so we'll say you know what would you like to uh, like to learn more about yeah and you say show me your products or it could be uh work one-on-one -on -one coaching or something one-on-one uh, -on -one yes coaching. yes right and again i mean you connect oh them. very nice and you say this goes in as for all actions. So now, just to give a quick pause, what it tells the everybody else looking at this particular flow is that the user starts from get started, gets the fitness shop message, and then gets the this particular message with buttons and options in it. So let's say they tap on show me your products. That's something that I think we can use generic template for. Now, if you're familiar with Facebook bots you know that you have generic templates that can turn into carousels. So you can have multiple products or yeah. items shown in a carousel view that they can scroll through. So we can do that over here. Uh, we will leave the product here. We'll say, this is my product one. Let's say water bottle. <laughs> sure. Right. Um, a Richard water bottle. Uh, let's do that. <laughs> Keeps your water fresh and cool. Nice. Right. And then you can link, and these are all the elements that, uh, um, let's say, richardfitness.com. These are all the <laughs> elements that uh, Facebook allows you to customize. So you can customize as to the T and the dot to what Facebook allows you to do. This so is amazing, yeah. 
Yeah, view details. And because we have more than one product, we'll add another one. I'm just gonna use a dummy image. Over yeah, here. go for it. And uh, let's do another one. What was the other product you had? Um, let's just say a t-shirt, like a, like the, the sweat, like the what the water, I don't know, what are those called? Like the ones water. that, you, water resistant uh, tops, where it feels really good when you work out on. Yeah. Uh, keeps you fresh while you work out. Any domain you want, really. Sure, sure. Um, these are just filler, right? Absolutely. I mean, yeah, this is we're just creating a prototype. So yeah. these are not actual things that need to be there. So now you can see you have your two items in there, and you can add as many as you want that Facebook allows you to add. Um, and then we'll connect this over here, and we'll say that hey, this is when show me your products is <laughs> yes. All right. So now we have. At this particular stage, we have options. We gave options to the user, so we have to map out all the options. So let's say what, what happens when they click on one-on-one -on -one coaching, right? So perhaps we want to give them a nice little text message that says something like, I don't know, awesome. Let's get you up uh, with our one-on-one -on yes, yes. coaching session. And I'll, I'll show you what uh, it can do for you is that um, now you're connected, right? Mm -hmm. And then we can say this is for one on one coaching, right? And it's already taking shape, it's already getting into a point where you're looking and saying, Oh, how the user is going to flow through this whole conversation, right? This big map, then you can create as many detailed maps as you want. No, I, um, I love it, and also like. If you're working with a client, like for example, myself, Richard, the fitness guy, who does not know anything about bots, this makes it so clear. Well, did you, do that again. You just yeah, yeah. move the whole uh, map, uh, right? Yeah, good. So yeah. basically, as I said, I mean, you can you can actually have a big map, and you can pan around, you can zoom out of zoom out in. So you can have a large map. You can clearly see and visualize where the. Yes. Yeah. This is awesome. So let's say after this, you want to ask for location. So ask for location. And uh, I'm just going to pan down a little bit. Um, and you would say something like, first, tell us where are you located? Right. And then you can say, send my location. This is awesome. I'm going to be the best fitness guy now. <laughs> Shoot. Absolutely. And this is really, really interesting because we actually have templates to show that they have sent you their location. This is something that Facebook offers you. So if in your real life bot, that's how the user's location will come to you, or at least they will see it in their conversation. So you can actually visually see how things are. So let's just call it location. Very nice. Yeah. This is a great like MVP already of the, the first sequence of the bot. Absolutely. And as you can see, I mean, if we zoom out a little bit, we already took it's like five minutes, not even that. Yeah. And we're able to actually map out our conversation, That's not just with text boxes, not just with, you know, fake text here and there. But if you send this to your clients, or even if you present this to your clients, they can actually visualize how your bot is going to look using real Facebook components. Which I think, which is where our aim was, you know, we wanted to build something that gives you the realistic view of, yeah. of what the platform offers you. So you can play around with it. Yes, awesome. So cool. So, uh, so say uh, I'm Richard. I'm going to play Richard right now. Mm -hmm. All right. So this, this looks all cool and all, but uh, how does it actually look like in Messenger? Do I, how do I actually like try it out myself and see it in the, the Messenger view? Absolutely. So we have... This is one kind of view that we have on project. We're going to create a different project now, and we're going to call it the e-commerce mock, let's say mock, and you're going to select the mock type this time. And what happens in the mock view is you actually end up getting a window which looks like, acts like Facebook Messenger's chat view. 
Mm. And in this one, you can actually do the same components that you had over there, the same message templates that you had over there. You can insert them here too. Very so nice. What I'll do is I'll uh, quickly do, a, I'll cheat a little bit. And I'm going to open this one as well. Yeah, nice. So let's say I'll take this text over here. And I'll say, you know, there you go. Oh, so you double click on that. You enter your text here. Um, and then, and then what, so what each one of these particular. Yeah, yeah. You don't have to do the whole thing. But... Yeah. So this is representing one path. So we'll do one path quickly. Sure, sure. It won't take us that long. So let's say we do the button. And Richard, you're gonna have the best bot in the industry. It's just so realistic. And I just love it because this takes like five, 10 minutes and you don't have to actually build anything. You're just mocking um, it out. Yeah. Is it and mocking it out? Is that a word? <laughs> mapping it out? Mocking, mapping. Mocking, yeah. I don't call it really. <laughs> uh, it's just, it, it's, really easy to do right um I'll, i actually will stop right here and then we will use a reply yes we'll do a really cool thing so uh one-on-one -on -one coaching i think oh yeah one-on-one -on -one yeah, so yeah yeah nice. that's sick so sick so slick too yeah so we created one particular path it took us again not that much time to do it and once you have placed these items here you can reorder them quickly too so let's say you decide that hey you know what i'm gonna have this before this particular message yeah whichever way you want visualization uh, you visually can see each and every single sort of conversation flow but here's yeah. a cool part you can actually copy this particular board and have two versions of it. So now you can say things like, ah, welcome cool. to my fitness shop with some customized message, let's say, right? And, you know, talk about A-B testing. You can already do that without having to go into any bot development platform. Mm. Because what you can do is you can actually send a particular link to your customer or your users with A or B, and yeah. then they get to see version A or B, and you get to see the comments coming in and all that stuff around it. So nice. Now, uh, here's, here's a, the awesome part. You can actually preview it, and you were saying, you know, how do we preview it in real life and how the conversation will look like? You actually simulate it in our oh, simulation. Oh, so cool. And do the actions for you. So when you send this to your customers, they're not just imagining things. They actually get to see it. This is awesome. I actually don't remember... I remember the preview part, but I think you added that feature where it looks like the user actually clicks on the button. Like it highlights yeah, a little that, bit. That's right? something we did recently. And we're adding more and more features as we go where, you know, you'll be able to control a lot more interactions as well. Uh, as, said, I mean, <laughs> as realistic as possible. This is awesome. Is there anything else that we did not cover yet that you, that we, that you think that, okay, we have to cover this part? Because this is already overwhelmingly like super useful. Yeah. Oh, I and mean, this is basically what you need to get started. I mean, that's yeah. the basic thing that you want to do. The only other thing is you can actually invite your team members as well. So team collaboration is built in. So if you have a team members with more people in it and you have different clients coming in, you can invite a client to a particular project Perfect. and they get to work with you and put in comments and all that stuff around it. Awesome. It's basically like Envision, right? Envision for the, the bot chatbots. Application. That's a great way to look at it. Yes, it's Envision for chatbots. and Envision for chatbots. Yeah. That's awesome. Okay, Obey, where can people find Botmalock? And also, how, do they, how can they find you? Are you on Twitter? Are you on Facebook? I'm on Twitter, so you can easily find me. under. <laughs> or you can find Botmalock under Twitter slash Botmalock. Oh, very nice. And you can follow, the, follow us. Or you can find me at twitter.com slash Obey, and you will find me. By you and the website. Let me just move this out of the way one second. So the website is botmog.com. So not not here. So this is the website, botmog.com. Nice. Uh, started for free. And uh, we have monthly plans. We have actually if you, you save about 20% if you sign up for yearly ones. Uh, but you, you come with a trial. So if you want to try out what the professional plan gives yeah. you, you can try it for 15 days. If you don't like it, switch back to full, so free plan and continue using it.
Awesome. I encourage everyone to go use this. We actually have a special promo code. If you type in bot academy, B O T uh, Academy, A C A D E M M Y, um, you'll get 25% off of bot mock. And we do it because we love bot mock. We, uh, we use it all the time when we build our own sequences and thank you so much for coming on and just sharing about the platform. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah. If you're looking to build bots for clients, looking to build bots for your own business, um, and need a way to visualize, I'm a very visual learner, visualize your flow and your, um, sequence, your sequences, the message, how they actually play out in messenger. We highly recommend botmock.com. Obey, thank you so much for coming on. Thanks a lot, Dan.